100 years ago, I turned 50. It was a halfway point in my life. Not because I think I'm going to live to be 100. Now I just do things halfway. In case I get tired and need to take a nap. Uh, I just came out of a divorce. I was married 33 years. No, you don't applaud that. <laughs> that you applaud, the 50 years. <laughs> and um, so I was thinking back, what went wrong? What could have gone wrong? So I remember we were dating, and she said, uh, tell me something in French. I said, chérie, tu ressembles à la vache, qui a la cloche autour de ton cou, et quand tu goûtes ça sonne. She said, oh, my, that sounds beautiful. What does that mean? said, you look like a cow with a bell around your neck, and when you walk, it rings. I'm pretty sure that had something to do with the divorce, because women never forget. So I've been, uh, you know, on some dating sites now. Uh, I was very lucky. I met my uh, beautiful girlfriend. I was on Seniors Meet. She's on our time, and they pimped her out over to Seniors Meet. Now, let's see how I say this delicately. Um, on some of these sites, some of these women are probably not a type for anybody. I mean, bonemarrowmatch.com, Christian shingles, hook up my oxygen, let's share a defibrillator. So speaking of senior dating, I was doing a gig at a uh, senior assisted living facility because <laughs> That's where my career is right now. And I was reading through the newsletter, and there was a personal ad. So let me share this with you. S-O-M, single old man. 90. Looks 83. Full use of right side. ISO. PYT. 55 to 75. Must love long, slow shuffles. An applesauce. Can you imagine this guy in a bar picking up women? Hey, baby. Do I come here often? It's kind of scary. You know, 10,000 people a day turn 65 in this country. Call that the silver tsunami. And I had a little bit of a moral dilemma with these dating sites because there are some women who post pictures of themselves with their adult age daughters, who some of them are very beautiful. Is it wrong to connect with them in the hopes that you might get a chance to meet them? Maybe. So I guess it is wrong for some of you, all right. So uh, just to wrap up, my, um, I'm very entrepreneurial. And uh, you know, so what's the most popular genre of TV show out there today? Yeah. Reality shows, very good. So I think there ought to be some reality shows more geared towards seniors. So I'll give you a few of my ideas before I pitch them to the uh, TV execs. So we'll start with uh, Jersey bed sores. So you think you can fall. Mall walking with the stars. Keeping up with the prescriptions. And for the do-it-yourselfers, this old hospice. And here's the closer. Pimp my hover round. All right, that's my time. Thanks very much. You're awesome. See you again soon.